O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. Creator of the stars of night, the people's everlasting light, Redeemer, Saviour of us all, O hear your servants when they call, as once through Mary's flesh you came, to save us from our sin and shame. So now, Redeemer, by your grace, come heal again our fallen race. And when on that last judgment day we rise to glory from decay, then come again, O Saviour blessed, and bring us to eternal rest. The Lord is my light and my help. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is my light and my help. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is a strong of my life. Before whom shall I shrink? When evil do is draw near, to devour my flesh. It is they, my enemies and foes, who stumble and fall. Though an army encamp against me, my heart would not fear. Though war break out against me, even then would I trust. There is one thing I ask of the Lord, for this I long, to live in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to savour the sweetness of the Lord, to behold his temple. For there he keeps me safe in his tent in the day of evil. He hides me in the shelter of his tent on a rock he sets me safe. And now my head shall be raised above my foes who surround me. And I shall offer within his tent a sacrifice of joy. I will sing and make music for the Lord. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. The Lord is my light and my help. Whom shall I fear? It is your face, O Lord, that I seek. Hide not your face. O Lord, in my voice when I call, have mercy and answer. Of you my heart has spoken, seek his face. It is your face, O Lord, that I seek, hide not your face. Dismiss not your servant in anger, you be my help. Do not abandon or forsake me. O God, my help, 
Thou Father and Mother, forsake me. The Lord will receive me. Instruct me, Lord, in your way. And an even path lead me. When they lie in ambush, protect me from my enemy's greed. False witnesses rise against me, breathing out fury. I am sure I shall see the Lord's goodness in the land of the living. Up in him, hold firm and take heart. Hope in the Lord. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. The God who is, who was, and is to come at the end of the ages. It is your face, O Lord, that I seek. Hide not your face. He is the firstborn of all creation. He is supreme over all creatures. Let us give thanks to the Father who has qualified us to share in the inheritance of the saints in light. He has delivered us from the dominion of darkness and transferred us to the kingdom of his beloved Son in whom we have redemption, the forgiveness of sins. He is the image of the invisible God the firstborn of all creation, for in him all things were created, in heaven and on earth, visible and invisible. All things were created through him and for him. He is before all things, and in him all things hold together. He is the head of the body, the church. He is the beginning, the firstborn from the dead, that in everything he might be preeminent. For in him all the fullness of God was pleased to dwell, and through him to reconcile to himself all things, whether on earth or in heaven, making peace by the blood of his cross. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. He is the firstborn of all creation. He is supreme over all creatures. There must be no passing or premature judgment. Leave that until the Lord comes. He will light up all that is hidden in the dark and reveal the secret intentions of men's hearts. Then will be the time for each one to have whatever praise he deserves from God. Come to us and save us, Lord God Almighty. Come to us and save us, Lord God Almighty. Let your face smile on us, and we shall be saved. Come to us and save us, Lord God Almighty. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Come to us and save us, Lord God Almighty. The law will go forth from Zion, and the word of the Lord from Jerusalem. My soul glorifies the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God my Saviour. He looks on his servant in a lowliness, henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy is name. His mercy is from age to age on those who fear him. He puts for his arm in strength and scatters the proud hearted. He casts the mighty from their thrones 
and raise the lowly. He fills the starving with good things, sends the rich away empty. He protects his really servant, remembering his mercy. The mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever, world without end. The Lord will go forth from Zion, and the word of the Lord from Jerusalem. Let us pray to God the Father, who is Lord and ruler of all. Come and visit your people. Come as the shepherd to tend your flock. Gather all men into the unity of the church. Come and visit your people. Lord, remember all the sons of Abraham, all who await your promise in faith. Come and visit your people. We pray for those who seek to escape from life. Lord, give them hope to live by and courage to persevere. Come and visit your people. Remember those who have died. Show them the glory your Son has gained for them. Come and visit your people at the Saviour's command and form by divine teaching. We dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. <clears throat> Prepare our hearts, Lord, by the power of your grace. When Christ comes, may he find us worthy to receive from his hand the bread of heaven and the feast of eternal life. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.